Hi, it's Deborah from DebraConrad.com, and I am showing my friend today how to add an image in that is going to be a clickable link for an Amazon product. First, you are going to need an ad, add an image. I'm going to go over to Amazon and I've picked a product and here's an image of it. Let me scroll over there so you can see it. There's the image. So I want to save the image to my desktop, but let's call it something. Like Minwax Polycrylic, like that. And I'm saving it to my desktop so I can find it easily. And back to my blog post. You click on the little frame link and you browse and you find a Minmax Polycrylic and you insert it as a JPEG upload. JPEGs are always uh, smaller and pretty web friendly so they're good, good size to enter. So then you can see right here it has a link which you want it to look like none so you can you click on none so you can insert your Amazon affiliate link. Right back to Amazon. Right up here at the top, you click a link to page. And you just want the text link again and you want to make sure you are within those quotes. Don't Make the same mistake I do often and get those quotes in there. It makes a mess. Copy back to your blog post where you still have that open for your link. And I am going to post this left. I have a reason. Full size. Insert into post. Now, there's the picture. It's a pretty good size picture. So if I wanted to crop that down so that it was smaller, and looked better on my post. I use Microsoft Office Picture Manager and you want to go up here to Edit Pictures and over here at the right hand side let me, I'm trying to scroll over for you I can click on Crop which brings up these little X's or corners and I'm bringing that down so that it's still got some white space around it but it's much smaller. Okay. I'm going to save it. Uh, the same picture name. It's just saving it again. If you want to add some white space around this before you add in your text you would click on this picture bar again and you're going to go to advanced settings and I already have a margin in there so I'm going to take that out and what you would do would be to click on this or add in the 10 and then click there and add in a 10 and have it open in a new window if you want to have two windows open up or leave it uh, unchecked to have it open up uh, just in it from your blog onto Amazon and click update and now you can see when I start typing every dog in the neighborhood is barking right now sorry so then we're gonna we could put, put, uh, have a hyperlink right there as well um, so that would go in your blog post and then I, I'm going to click Save Draft. And then we're going to preview the post. And there you can see my title. And when you scroll down, all this garbage is showing up because I don't have an article in there. But if I hover over my image you can see right down here that it had right in this space right down here it'll have the link that that's going to so you can see it so there's the link right there that made this if I click on that image 
I'm going to Amazon right to the product. Pretty cool.